number divided by a fraction. In division, we remember that order matters. And so in this problem, 1 fourth divided by 3, I am starting by going to show the 1 fourth. Step 1 is to draw your model and represent the fraction with columns. So here's my whole model, and I need to show 1 fourth of this. So I'm going to cut it half and half again. So now I have my four columns, because my denominator is a four, and I need to shade one-fourth. Okay. Next, I need to divide it into three. And this time, we divide the model into rows to match this whole number. So I need three rows going across my model. And yes, this is the one-fourth, but I'm going to go all the way across to show how it changes the whole model. And then our quotient is going to be to name the size of one piece of the model. And so here is my one fourth. If I get one of those pieces, I am getting one out of how many though, because the model has been cut into more pieces than just four. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. 12, I should say. So I've got 1 fourth divided by 3, which is equal to 1 twelfth. Alright, let's do another. Draw a model to show this division. I am saving one third of a pound of chocolate to eat later. And yes, I could eat the whole one third myself, but let's keep reading. If I share it with the entire fifth grade team, what fraction of the chocolate will each person get? All right, so I have one third of a pound. I need to show that first. So my problem is going to be one third divided by, let's see, the entire fifth grade team. That's the four teachers and Mrs. Plum. She likes chocolate too. So I'm going to divide by five. So I need to show this one third first. Here's my model. I'm going to start by cutting it into thirds and shading one of those since I only had one third of a pound. Okay, so there's my one third of a pound, and I'm going to now have to cut it into five rows going across, since I'm going to share it with five people. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so there's my five rows. I could have this piece, and the other teachers could each pick one piece for themselves. All right, so if this is my piece, I'm going to only get one of those pieces, and so that is one out of how many now? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. So I would get one fifteenth of a pound of chocolate to eat for myself. All right, in your math journal, I would like for you to draw a model to show this division. Start with showing the fraction that they have and then cutting it into rows to match your whole number.